Thank you for copyright. Thank oh, you for the copyright. But other than that, let me check. I hope the back is looking cute. But yeah, this was actually very, very unexpected. I'm loving it so much. Keep it on pressure. I'm trying to love you like a gangster. Baby, you can suck. I'm skin like Eva. Sweet by Indo. Should I get you? Mommy, keep it cool. Let's hop in my Maserati. Baby, hop in my Maserati. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to the channel, my name is Emma. If you're not new, what's up, goodies? Have you guys been? How you guys doing? I hope you guys are having a blessed, great, wonderful, amazingly awesome day. As you can see, I am as usual. So let's get right into the video. So as you can see from the title, I'm doing a Bantu knot for the first time on like a Bantu knot out. I don't know what you call it. But yeah, it's basically, this is the result. So if you want to see how I achieve this hairstyle, just go ahead and watch. And if you're into these types of videos, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe for more fun content, okay? Alright guys, so I'm starting off freshly washed and blow dried hair. Um, so this hairstyle, again, I'm not an expert. I think this is the first time or like second time in a while that I've done this style. The last time I did it, that was like in 20, I think 17 or 18. So I'm just going to start with my conditioner and I'm doing it on dry hair. I'm not really going to put water on it because I want it to be flowy and bouncy in a way. So I'm just gonna go in with my conditioner, applying it on my roots thoroughly, then brushing the strands. And then I'm not gonna put a lot of product, though I do want it to be moisturized and a little curly. I'll just do my best to like not put a lot of product. But you can go ahead and put water if you want to. So after that, I just comb it out to make sure there are no tangles, then twist the hair. I'm just gonna wrap it and wrap the hair around itself. Then I'm gonna go ahead and do the bantu knot and this part is kind of tricky for me to show you and explain so just bear with me So for this process, you're just gonna have to fold the hair after you've wrapped the hair around itself You're just gonna fold the hair and then wrap it again around itself into like a little ball or like a little knot The key here is to make sure that as you fold it together, like you're wrapping the hair around itself into that knot, you make it really, really tight and secure. And don't make it too tight because you can get a headache. The next day, I think I almost got a headache. But yeah, I'm just going to repeat the same process, putting some conditioner on dry hair and then brushing it out, then wrapping it um, into like a loose spaghetti, <laughs> then proceeding to bending it and twisting it and put in the bantu knot i really hope y'all can see because it was kind of challenging for me to wrap it like use both my hands and make y'all see and my goodness i have a lot of hair y'all excuse that but like some of them are not well done but i do try my best to make it tight enough again this is my first time doing this style in a while so i hope this is helpful to you guys so as I was getting to the front, I was getting the hang of it. So just make sure as you're wrapping it like that, it's really, really tight and not it's tight enough, not too tight to hurt your hair. And then wrap it, you know, like you see me do, wrap it around itself, wrap it around itself, and that's practically it. When I got to the middle, my hands were literally hurting, honestly. So the middle part is not going to be as tight as it should be, but just try your best to make sure it's secure. All right, guys, so just watch me repeat the same process and, you know, just wrap that part around. And that's basically it for the video. I done caught a wave at a young age. Niggas getting paid doing dumb things. Make a little money and they act strange. All these girls really want one thing. Okay, guys, so I was gonna take it out the next day. You leave it to sit in. Huh? Because I don't like the way my head looks and bounce a lot. It looks. Mm. But yeah, I did it on, what's the name, Tuesday, yeah, Friday, so I let it sit today, Saturday, so I was going to take it out tomorrow, Sunday, but I'm going out spontaneously, so, and I also put like a rope oil all around like my, whatchamacallit, my scal
some oil on your hands to be able to take it on smoothly. So just watch me do that. And I really hope this tutorial is helpful because it's my first time. So these are my essential oils right here. The ones I usually use in my videos, um, coconut oil, jojoba oil, yeah. Oh, this is bad. Me doing my hair in my room. This is the one that came out weird. I think I put too much oil on my hands. Oh, it's actually dry. Okay. Oh, so honestly, I don't even have like a specific method of taking this out. Just start like from the bottom, I guess. Just be careful. I think with this hairstyle, you're gonna have like some level of frizz. So just unravel it as smoothly as you can. But then I'm in a rush, so don't follow me. <laughs> Bantu knots are actually cute. Well, like when you take it out. But if you can rock like bantu knots like this and go out, props to you. Oh wow, it's actually curly. I'm excited for this. What? All right, all right, all right. And for like a better video, I'm gonna link, of course, a video of like another person's channel down below. So you can go ahead and check that out. With a better explanation, more expertise. I'm a I'm a baddie. Yeah, I know I look better than all the girls that you know before. Had a chance, but I'm not playing anymore. Oh my gosh, this is actually cute. Oh my god. Wow. Silly boy, silly boy, silly boy. I don't need a man, young goodbye. Period. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and do like the rest off camera and then come back with the final results. And be careful, like this one tangled. So apply more like oil on your hands. Alright y'all, so I'm almost done. I just wanna show you guys this could also like when you take this out, could also be a style, then just like stretch it with the comb. But, all right, you guys. So this is the final result of the hair. Come on, come on. First down. So yeah, it's looking curly, bouncy. I haven't stretched it like uh, fully, so I'm just gonna leave it like this, and then see. Hopefully, it, like increases as the days go by. Or I find like a way to stretch it. But this part, this part is kind of free frizzy. Thank you for copyright. Thank you for the copyright. <laughs> yes, but. Crazy. We're not gonna talk about it. But other than that, let me turn. I hope the back is looking cute. But yeah, this was actually very, very unexpected. I'm loving it so much. The makeup came out right. You know, my fit is cute. Go on my TikTok and look at the full fit. I'm looking bomb and gorgeous as always. And yeah, this is the end of the video. Yeah, I like this. I like it like this. Covering my forehead. But yeah, you guys, if you like the video, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe if you want to know for more fun content. Go ahead and check out my playlist. I do natural hair, motivation, um, fashion, and fun, exciting vlogs. If you like hair, stay. And remember, feel loved, you're blessed, you're valued, and enjoy your heart always and always. Attracts the kingdom of God. Bye, loves.